Right here at 5 this Thursday, a special ed education leader in Hollister is gaining some national attention now for a book that she wrote about a heartbreaking experience. Color 10's Crystal Blair sat down and talked with that author. She joins us live in Branson with details. Crystal. Well, Heather and David, that book was already going live on uh, Amazon on March the 5th, and already in less than three weeks, it's on their best-selling list. And in the book, author Christina Smith, she chronicles her journey of learning that her husband had stage four cancer while she was seven months pregnant. The Amazon book, What I Wasn't Expecting When I Was Expecting, a grieving widow's memoir, has sold close to 1,000 copies across 34 states and five countries in a little more than three weeks. I keep saying using the word surreal, and that word does not even come close to what any of this is. So this was back in um, 2017. When Christina I Smith, a special education director for Hollister Schools, explained why she needed to share what she went through when her husband, Joe, of just one year, was diagnosed with colorectal cancer when she was seven months pregnant with their first child. The premise of this book was to heal. That was my number one goal. I just needed to heal. Joe passed away in 2014, about a year and a half after his diagnosis. I needed to process everything that had happened. I needed to cognitively dig deep and realize how the whole picture was connected. Um, and I just needed to put our love story on paper too. Writing has always been my outlet, first and foremost. Um, I've got a journal going at all times. When Joe got sick, one of my friends handed me a journal and said, there's gonna be a lot happen and you may not be able to say it out loud. Smith is thankful that Joe was able to see his son, Porter. You know, through the whole process, those first two months, seven and eight months pregnant, um, I kept telling God, this is not good timing. This is the worst timing ever. We have a baby coming. You don't understand. And, uh, and he did. He definitely understood because our son was the best medicine that we could have never asked for. It is better medicine than any doctor could have ever given him. And Smith is now a <laughs> national advocate for colorectal cancer awareness. Live in Branson, Crystal Blair, Ozarks First. Quite the story there tonight, Crystal. Thanks. And happy